Hi everybody, my name is Miss Heaney and today we are going to be talking about the capital moves. A capital is a city representing government. So today we're going to talk about Virginia and the capitals and where they were located. The capital of Virginia was Jamestown since 1607 and that lasted until 1698. That's 91 years that Jamestown was the capital. After um, Jamestown was established, they ran into some problems. And in 1698, the capital moved to Williamsburg. There's four reasons why the capital was moved from Jamestown to Williamsburg, located here on this map. Reason one was the drinking water was contaminated. It was marshy and brackish. Remember that the Chesapeake Bay had salt water and the James River, which Jamestown was on, had fresh water. So they mixed together and made brackish water. One of the reasons they picked Jamestown is they thought it had a good supply of fresh water, but they learned later it did not. This caused unhealthy living conditions. It made disease spread easier. So not only were they not getting the hydration they needed from their water and it was marshy and swampy, it created unhealthy living conditions and diseases were spreading rampant through Jamestown. The third reason was fire destroyed wooden and brick buildings. So fires would break out and it would burn to the ground. Jamestown would then be rebuilt and fires would break out again. The last reason is Williamsburg was already an established town. So Williamsburg was already a town close to Jamestown. So they decided to relocate the capital from Jamestown to Williamsburg. Williamsburg remained the capital of Virginia from 1699 until 1779. This means that Williamsburg was the capital of Virginia for 80 years. Then they moved the capital again. So they moved the capital from Williamsburg to Richmond for three important reasons. One, the population was moving westward for more opportunities. So we had a lot of people who were living around Jamestown and Williamsburg and the locations were kind of getting crowded. So people started moving westward. Um, also a lot of farms were becoming um, not profitable. They were trying to farm tobacco and other crops and the soil kind of failed them. So they started moving westward to try to rebuild their farms or for other job opportunities. The second reason was Richmond was a more central location. If you look at how big Virginia was, um, they didn't have cars back then, so they had to travel to different cities by horseback um, or by foot. Traveling all the way from the Appalachian Plateau to Williamsburg was pretty far, but Richmond was a more central location, which is why they chose to move it from Williamsburg to Richmond. And the last reason is Richmond is further from the sea and possible attack from the British. So Richmond and Jamestown are on the James River that we learned that in previous chapters. And Richmond is further from the sea. And at this time, Britain and the United States were having disagreements. Moving the capital inland more gave them more time to protect themselves in case the British chose to attack them. Richmond is still the current capital of Virginia since 1780. So we have been chilling out in Richmond and there have been no changes since then. I hope that this video helped you understand the reasons why the capital moved from Jamestown to Williamsburg and why the capital then moved from Williamsburg to Richmond. Be sure to review this video to memorize these reasons and check out your notes to help you on your activities, tests, and quizzes. Thanks for watching.